It's Halloween, so I'm going to tell you a spooky story. I'm pretty sure most schools these days have at least one creepy myth spreading about, like maybe a ghost appearing in a certain room, or hearing laughter in the hallways in the middle of the night. My school definitely had a few of those. So one day a few of my classmates decided they were going to form a group and they were going to see one of the ghosts. So one of them went up to ask me, Hey, you wanna see Ghost Girl? And I was bored. So, yeah, I said, fuck it, why not, let's go. So they planned it, and it was gonna happen at lunchtime, but I would have to skip lunch. But I would see a ghost. So, you know what, I thought it was worth it. So lunchtime came around, and everyone got called together, there were like five of us total, and we went to the place where the ghost would be. The gym. Well, it wasn't really inside the gym, it was at the entrance. So we head over there, and they didn't really tell me where it would appear, so I was just looking around for it. And it was like that for 10 seconds, and suddenly they all started screaming and running away. And I had no fucking idea what was going on, so I just ran behind them saying, Hey, what the fuck happened? And I followed them for a whole two floors upwards before one of them finally blurted out, Oh my god, it's a ghost, we saw it! But I didn't see one, so I was really confused. So we ran a bit more before they finally calmed down, and one of them said, Guys, I had my phone out, I managed to snag a picture. So we all took a look at the picture, and oh my god. It was just a picture of the entrance to the gym. No ghost. What a surprise. I have no idea if they actually saw a ghost, because apparently I was turned around the moment they saw the ghost. But I was very disappointed because I had to skip lunch for that, and I was very hungry. Anyways, one of them described the ghost as this girl who was really wet, and her hair was all messy and tangled up like seaweed. She said you could see the water dripping from her hair, but that she couldn't see any more details because the figure was really dark and she couldn't see much of it. She also said there was a story behind the ghost. Apparently there was a girl practicing basketball in the gym late at night. But then, the gym started to flood, which is really weird since the school's gym was in the third floor. But we're talking about ghosts and the paranormal activity shit, so... Anyways, the water level kept rising and eventually it went above her head and she couldn't breathe. So, she drowned. And that's the story. And that should have been that. But I don't believe in ghosts, so I tried to find a reasonable explanation as to why what happened, happened. And here's what I came up with. See, this is the basic layout of our gym. The entrance is here, and there's a big window over here. And our lunch period fell at a time where the sun would be positioned here. Now, why is any of this important? Well, let me explain. What if the janitor that cleans the gym was holding a mop upside down? Now, let's put him here. And if his positioning is just right, the shadow of him in his mop will be reflected on the entrance to the gym. And it'll look like a person with long, wet, dripping hair. I have no way of verifying if this is true, but if it is. The fact that a lot of people knew about this beforehand, to the point where they'd even make a backstory for it, meant the janitor had done this multiple times. And honestly... Well played, Mr. Janitor. Well played.